a reading of the New Testament as rendered by the uh, Gullah people. This is the Gullah Bible, uh, based on the King James Version of the Holy Bible. And as usual, we go to uh, any page. Let's go to uh, uh, Rome, or oh, Rome is this book, uh, Rome 16. And we'll go to uh, uh, number uh, 9. Rome 16, 9, on page uh, 558. Uh, I need my glasses for this because uh, the font is written well, much better. Uh, you know, the, the, the Gullah Geechee is written in that, that, that font, and the smaller font is right there. That's from the uh, King James Version of the Holy Bible. That's in that uh, Shakespeare, Christopher Marlowe kind of language, right? Uh, so that's what we read. Did I say I was going to read 9? Okay, let's do 9. Uh, Rome 69, five, uh, 558. Here we go. Uh, uh Urbanus, hey, he a man with the uh, walk for Christ with we. And I tell me that the Sakis, hey. And this is a uh, translation. Is salute Urban, our helper in Christ, and Sakis, my beloved. Again, it reads, uh, I don't tell Urbanus, hey, he a man would the work for Christ with we, and he don't tell me the for Saki, hey. Uh, and the translation, once again, is. We salute Urban, our helper in Christ, and Sakis, my beloved. Uh, again, I, I, I read out of the Gullah Bible because I want to be in contact with my, my uh, great-grandfather on my mother's side was uh, Gullah Geechee. And uh, so I, I read, I just take any passage and I just read it every now and again. And uh, I just feel like I'm being, uh, how do I say it, I, I, uh, in touch with my, my Gullah, my Maternal side, right? Well, let me explain this camera just a little bit. Um, and when I start, just to explain every once in a while, like hey, once and again, <laughs> I explain what I, how I, my set is, how I do. So this is a, a kente cloth that I got a long time ago somewhere. I got kente cloth usually from uh, West Africa, you know, uh, uh, Ghana usually, something like that. And uh, I particularly like this one. Um, and of course, the uh, Gullah Geechee Bible I got. This was from a small company, that's why it's black. Uh, usually you can get it from Amazon, but it's usually maroon, uh, the maroon color. I have that too. Uh, this hat I have on is, uh, well, the glasses come from the VA, my reading glass, like that. And so I, I, I take this and I usually uh, I kiss, I put it to my heart, uh, my mouth and my brain, like, you know, basically, uh, heart, spirit, right, or whatever you want to say, uh, uh, brain is like thought, and uh, speaking is speak. That's what, that's what that ritual is about. Um, and then, but the hat, the, 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 the cap, the crown, if you will, I try to pull it up like that. I try to make it ecumenical. Ooh, the brother used a big word. Um, and because it's actually, people think, I don't know what they think, they think because of the red star, they think some things, but this is what I call my Ogun cap because Though this is a, 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 a Christian text, uh, in fact, when I pray, uh, I give thanks and, pra and praises. I don't really petition God. I don't say ask for stuff. Uh, when stuff happens, as well, that's well. I, I say uh, I thank God. That's the Christian kind of interpretation. Uh, praise Alofi. Alofi was is the West African uh, thing. Alofi is also God. So I say, thank God, praise the Lord. Think of, you know, Bob Marley say, give thanks and praises. That's how I pray. When something happens, my prayer is like, well, thanks and praises. So I, so I say that uh, intimately whenever I feel like it, something good happens. I remember I said it was, I say it anytime. So I'm praying all the time. <laughs> uh, but the, the cap comes from the, um, the, the reason for the cap. The sea is green this side, right? But in, in, in uh, the Yoruba uh, culture, I'm what's called a child of a goon. Of goons colors and uh, and uh, goons come from the from the Yoruba culture in Nigeria and the colors there in Nigeria is blue. Uh, the goons color is blue, and when the uh, culture religion 
moved over to uh, South America, well, Brazil specifically, then the colors became, became blue and white. I haven't researched why that was, but it became blue and white. But when the culture, uh, now it's Conde Blay over blue and white, and blue and white, same uh, Orisha, uh, uh, Ogun. But when the, the, the Ogun, um, that, that religion and that culture came up to, to North America through Cuba, the strain, it changed to, uh, uh, for some reason, green and then black. That's why this side is, is black. But it's black. It's black on this side. And then with a bit of red, that's why I wear this cap. I can usually do this on the green side when I'm doing the readings, only because, uh, well, you know, my grandmother, you know, again, my maternal side, my grandmother, she was a, she's like a fashion maven, so I've always got to remember her and be, you know, coordinated. <laughs> Let's put it that way. So, but this is my Ogun cap. Uh, so it, it, it that's the whole thing. So it's this whole, I want to say, it's a whole cultural, religious, uh, spiritual uh, thing that I, that I do when I'm, when I'm dealing with the, uh, the New Testament as rendered by the color people, my people on my maternal side. Oh, and, oh, 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 and uh, uh, right now I'm in, uh, I'm in South Africa, I'm in Somerset West. I'm not, uh, when I get to uh, Dimbaza, where, where, I, where I live, in, in the Eastern Cape, then the set will change. But right now the set is what you see because I'm at a friend's house and I choose this background, you know. Well, I choose this background as a painting, brother, another brother. Uh, I guess I'm preparing myself for for, for Dimbaza because in Dimbaza, it, I have a I, I deal with a little community center I'm, um, I built on building. And um, and our focus is on the, it's for the entire community, but our focus is young men. So that's why you see this sort of preparing me for a, uh, for the Eastern Cape, All right? So there's an explanation, and uh, every once in a while you get a, a reading from, uh, from, as I said, from me, T from the Patterson's taking the chance to bet, letting you know what I only suspect. <laughs>